Good day and welcome to the internet Tottenham Stadium here in the nation's capital, Monrovia. It's again another football battle here for Liberia in the 2017 uh, African Cup of Nations qualifiers. Liberia is now poised to take on Djibouti right here today on this uh, 29th day of uh, uh, March. The year is still 2016. And of course, my name is Moses Gazza. We'll be bringing you live play-by-play -play descriptions here as it unfolds between Liberia and Djibouti. The rest is show men against the Lone Stars of Liberia. Liberia are currently at the top of the group with six points. Tunisia in second place and Togo in third place. Djibouti, who are with all the way, are lucky at the bottom of the table with uh, 11 goal deficits to speak of uh, in this uh, qualification process. Uh, I can tell you that uh, the momentum for this match hasn't been too high for Liberia. But uh, Liberians have still turned out looking at how Djibouti is up. It's not a footballing nation, not really a competitive side in African football. It's still grappling with challenges to see whether they can register his name on the international football soldier. The referees are from Cape Verde uh, that will be in charge of this match today. Already we've had some uh, new team news for Liberia. Uh, Dauda Batu, uh, who plays in Norway, he's doing the 117 and 120 shots for the Norwegian national football team has started to uh, and finally decide on his uh, international football uh, future uh, by uh, being called up to the Liberian national football team, the Lone Star. Uh, Tommy Songole is between posts as usual for Liberia. Uh, some new changes in central defense today. We have uh, Omega Rabos. He's going to be uh, uh, playing alongside Tia Dennis and Daka Glenn is now called up in the first 18 men squad for the Lone Stars of Liberia. Gizzy Double is also all of this lineup. We got young uh, Hilton Vining who comes from Barrack Young Controllers on the local scene. He's also part of this squad today. But we'll be giving you the full lineup of the Lone Star team and also the Djibouti national team who have both of their players coming from uh, Jabatel, uh, a, a top side in the Djibouti Football League. Uh, who made up their national football team. Djibouti, Djibouti arguably uh, a lot in the international football cycle. 
is grappling with qualification process in this 2017 African Cup of Nations qualifier. Keep watching LNTV News as we go through to bring you the latest actions that is on force here at the Antoinette Tottenham Stadium in Monrovia. As we, we can say here today is that uh, the national football team of Liberia is still poised to take on Djibouti at about 16 hours local time, but uh, the deputy coach is Kevin Sibwe. Uh, Kevin, a couple of new changes in your squad today uh, comparing to the last team that played away from Rome in Djibouti City. Uh, tell us about the new inclusion we know about Dauda Batu uh, in the starting 11. Well, Dauda Batu is not in the starting 11. But he's a young lad uh, who's playing in uh, Norway. What we try to do is to uh, exploit uh, other opportunities to have uh, some uh, librarians from overseas who have not played in the country. You know, little by little, we are building a team. So we cannot, we, we cannot only uh, uh, look at the team for now. We're trying to build up the same time for the future. That's why you see our players will be coming in every now and then. Gizzy Double is out, Dagat Blade is out, Ominga Rabo comes in, and the young Hilton Vani are playing the local league is also in the lineup today. Well, as you can see in all departments, we make changes in all departments. Uh, Hilton Vani is no stranger to Liberia, Liberia football, maybe to the national team. Yes, but he's a young lad, very good, want to give him the opportunity. Central defense, you found out that Omega Rabba returned to the team. Uh, he's in a great form. We also want to have him play today. In the midfield, uh, Keita comes back to the team because he, he did not play the last game. He was on the bench and uh, he, he's going to make a start today. Uh, off front, Jebo returned and definitely we're giving his place. So you see, in all departments, we made some changes uh, and we're hoping that we're doing it for the best. Kevin, the last time the Liberians were quite disappointed. A cross middle, you had 80% of ball possession, but managed to score a goal after creating lots of chances. Well, you know, football is like that. Uh, let's remember that we were playing a nation and we were playing their home. Uh, I think it's the first time they actually managed to play a good game after a long while because uh, they, they've been defeated at home by so many teams. And uh, uh, the, the fact that we did not score early gave them some confidence. But I don't think we should lose hope because we didn't score a lot of goals. Uh, our team is still learning. We're learning to win. We're still in the, in the beginning. Uh, today, we want to hope that we can put out a splendid performance first and then see we can get a lot of goals beginning with the first goal so we all can be in the fiesta together. Liberia, you are still learning to get back-to-back uh, -back wins in uh, international football. The exact words of uh, Kevin Sibwe, the deputy coach of the Liberia national football team, the Lone Star, as we build up to the match Liberia versus Djibouti. But this is just a sideline of the, the substitute bench here for Liberia. Um, Zach Kringer, 31 years old, having Makona play for BYC in Liberia, a past chairman uh, from Santos in South Africa. The young Dauda Batu, 21 years old, is making his, uh, his first international appearance for Liberia as a substitute. Uh, the experienced Dooley Johnson from uh, NK Model uh, is also part of this uh, squad today. He's having a pep talk with uh, a bit of warm up. It's a two by two they are doing here. He's there alongside the W10, uh, Dauda Batu. Uh, Seku Kwane, who has now switched from, uh, from uh, the Dutch Second Division League, is now in the US. Uh, he's also part of this uh, substitute uh, lineup for Liberia. And if you just go to the, sub uh, the starting lineup for Liberia, I can see from here quite well uh, Willem Jebo, uh, Theo Week Lewis, uh, who is making his uh, return, Sam Johnson. He's also part of that squad. Anthony Slotin Lafour, Tia Dennis, who is the captain for this squad, uh, all just in this uh, cycle. We have uh, Ominga Rabo Alamadin all the way on the far side. Uh, the tallest in fight on this squad. Uh, Dior Williams, uh, one of the most experienced. He hasn't had a lot of cup for his uh, team this season. Uh, Solomon Grahams uh, from Sapros. Uh, then Asani Keita. Uh, he's from France in the Division 2 league. He's also part of this uh, uh, squad today. So that's how the Liberian squad will be. 
But for Jim Stalin Sadiba, <laughs> I don't see him uh, in his regularly, officially dress code. Diba is actually noted to be someone who uh, dress up in his coat suits, but not uh, really that it is today. Thomas Kojo, also former of the National Football Team of Liberia, uh, he's also a member of this technical squad of the Liberian National Football Team, the Lone Star. And sure, we can say that the warmer wave uh, will conclude here for Liberia uh, as the starting team is wrapping up now, having some pep talks uh, to move into the lockup room. The referees come from uh, Cape Verde. All of the four referees come from Cape Verde and they will be in charge of this all important occasion here at the Antonio Totmo Stadium in Monovia. <laughs> Well, it's not just uh, uh, a matter of time now that Liberia will take on Djibouti in the qualifiers of the of the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations qualifiers here at the Antwerp Tottenham Stadium. Uh, the two teams, uh, as you come up five, Joe Williams, one of the veterans for this team, is number nine. Joe Weeks Lewis is number four. Hilton Vanin is number uh, 12. And we have uh, uh, Solomon Grams uh, is number eight. Uh, the young uh, Tommy Songol of Les KFC is wearing number 16 jersey. He reminds me of uh, uh, Louis Creton when the captain is. Uh, uh, Tia Dennis of uh, Atelide in Jordan and the match of features are from uh, uh, Cape Verde they are from Cape Verde uh, but we can just uh, roll down the Djibouti uh, who line up will be calling you today. as you can see they are dressed up uh, in their dominant, dominant green uh, with a touch of white on the shoulder they are actually a new side in international football uh, we hope uh, they can rise up to the occasion and try to give Africa uh, that pedigree of, uh, of footballing uh, the world is uh, made of. First, now is the national anthem of the Republic of Djibouti. the national team of Liberia, the Lone Star of Liberia, quest now to take on the Djibouti national football team in this qualifiers of the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations here at the Antoinette Todman still in Moldova. We have a handshake between uh, the two teams 
and uh, Djibouti the same. We are coming to <laughs> shake hands, uh, to shake hands with their Liberian counterpart instead of uh, Liberia uh, doing the same. And I can tell you that it's going to be a really, really exciting encounter here. The Djibouti national football team dress up in their uh, real green outfit. Uh, I going against the Liberian counterpart here. They lost the first match at home by a goal to nil, and Captain Captain Tia Dennis will be exchanging panel with uh, the captain of the Djibouti national football team. But they will be posted for a photo shop yet, and they come from Jabatel, most of them. And I tell you that uh, uh, the new staff Liberia dressed up in the uh, uh, blue office straps, uh, a red shirt. And Coach Kevin Sebwet is uh, having some pep talks now with uh, uh, Tio Weeks, who is uh, actually uh, the man who is responsible to play the ball forward for their offensive players. And Kevin Sebwet was one man noted in Liberia's football history as uh, one of the best midfielders. Coach Jim Salisa Deva is like everyone uh, going around each player. And Deba now can meet this real man, uh, which arguably I can say he missed in the first encounter, Willem Jabo. Captain Tia Dennis now is going to have his final pep talk to this uh, uh, coach, this coach. This is just a substitute bench of the Liberian national football team, the Lone Star. Uh, they are dressed up in their circle of faith, as you can see anywhere. Welcome for Liberia, Tia Dennis, Solomon Grams, Hilton Vanning, Ominga Rabos, Tio Weeks, Joe Williams, Anthony Lafour, Sam Johnson, Willem Jabo, Asani Keita complete the start and up for the Lone Star of Liberia. Hassan Hodi, Wilda, Mohamed Kader, Yusuf Batu, Mohamed Bert, Wasama Musa, Mogomen Hoin, Musa Ahmed, Abu Bakar Omar, Abu Bakar Dahir, and Mohamed Maradi complete the starting order for the guys from Djibouti. And I can just tell you that uh, most of the guys uh, uh, for Djibouti national football team, arguably all of them play at home. They come from uh, Brother Rami, Jabatel leading the list of uh, their players, AS Post. Also leading uh, the lineup, uh, University. They got one player there from uh, University uh, in the Djibouti lineup. That's uh, Mohammed Hussein. He's uh, number nine. And I tell you, their captain is uh, Mohammed Kadet, the number six. He's going to be playing uh, in central defense. He's going to be playing in central defense uh, alongside alongside Wild Dao. Liberia kicks it off. Two weeks. Plays a long one. It's just held it over. Uh, I think Weeks was looking for Anthony Lafour. Lafour throws it quickly to Hilton Vanny. Ominga Rabos out of Madin. Rabo posts it high. Sam Johnson goes up, but he's held it away now. But Djibouti is cleared. Uh, by Musad Ahmed. Omega. Omega tries to give it away, but he goes all the way back to Tommy Songo. Hilton Vani to Keita. Keita has been chased. Finds Solomon Grams. Grams on to Dio Williams. Williams finds Hilton. Hilton brings it down. Finds Keita in midfield. Keita onto Tio Weeks. Tio onto Lafour now. Lafour to Tio Weeks. This is Liberia making way. Tio Weeks goes down, but his ball is just cleared easily across the line by Wasama Musa. Weeks is down. And the throw was taken quickly. Dio Williams to Tia Dennis now. Dennis looking for Solomon Grams, but Tia comes in. Win it back. Tietis Grams down. Grams trying to pull out of run. 
Grand placed it through, looking for Sam Johnson. But it's intercepted by Dow. Dow placed it through. This is Djibouti. This player goes down, foul. Foul committed by Tio Wies. That's the first foul in this match. Liberia gives it away. Tia Dennis, the captain, always on time, brings it under control, receives a return from Solomon Grams. Ominga Rabos. Rabos looking for Lafort now. It's held away. <laughs> held away by Tio Tekken. Tio Weeks. Place it through the gap for Dior Williams. We're not trying to get away, but he's been close up by Bato. He finds Grams now. Keita. Back to Grams, but Grams goes all the way back to Tia Dennis. Omega Rabos out of Madain. Rabos on to Keita. Keita to Tia Dennis. To Tommy Songo. Songo. To Tia Dennis. Dennis back to Songo. Hilton Vani. Vani on to Lafour. Jabo can chase. And, and it's across. Nice defensive work by the skipper, Mohamed Kadet. Lafour now with it. Lafour got the Uno goal in that match. Anthony Lafour. This is Hilton Vanny squares one in the area. He's selling away. This is Joe Weeks. Weeks shoots! <laughs> but too easy for Howdy, who right foot it. Then it goes there. The referee says it's no foul. Asani Keita. Keita looking for Sam Johnson. But here comes the captain now. The first time they're moving forward. This is the captain moving deep. Cadet. Cadet looking for Ahmed. Ahmed can post one in the area. This is Liberia. It's giving away. Djibouti with a chance. That plays it through a gap. Now Abu Bakar Omar trying to trip through the area. Anthony Lafour is building to it. Collation there. Djibouti. Number 20 now for Djibouti is uh, Musa. Liberia, zero Djibouti, zero. In the opening five minutes, Liberia have a better hand of possession. Dior Williams getting away. Williams, can, Williams is there. Williams getting away from this marker. Nice defensive work. It's intercepted. Omar gives it away to Solomon Graham. Skater, two weeks now. Looking for Lafort to break away. This is Skater. Hilton Vani. Vani on to Lafour. Lafour back to Keita. Keita is saying, take your own time. Two weeks. Having some holiday in midfield. The captain, Tia Dennis. Tia Dennis find Dior Williams. Williams is there to Solomon Grams. Grams is beating. Into the ball by... Hoying. This is uh, Djibouti breaking away. Hoying on the possession. Quick. A long ball through the area. Anthony Lafour is there for Liberia. And the referee says it's foul on the far side of the field. That player is still all the way down. Flat on the ground. He comes off finally. Um, you can see his number from here. I think that was... Uh, Mohamed Mohammed Met. The kick sticking. Tip. Djibouti. Liberia intercepts. This is uh, Omega Rabos. And we can just uh, confirm to you that uh, Madam President has just arrived here at the ATS. As has been announced by the protocol. The bar is now into play in a danger area. Well, I'm double shoots. 
William Jabo, he scored a hat trick against Guinea Bissau in the preliminary stage of the World Cup qualifiers for Liberia were eliminated by Cote d'Ivoire. Number 17 for Djibouti in possession now. This is uh, Djibouti. This player getting away from his marker. He turns around quickly. Hoying. It's cleared. Wolong Jabo. Miscommunication between Sam Johnson and uh, Jabo. Jabo trying to use some. Uh, this is Jabo. Jabo is there. Jabo goes down. And it's penalty for Liberia. Penalty for Liberia. Seven minutes, 19 seconds. William Jabo goes down in the area. Great coordination between Jabo and Sam Johnson. And Jabo tries to keep his ground, but he was still brought down by the captain, Mohamed Kadel. Kadel gets the yellow card. And so he's not happy with the decision in any way. And just one more eight minutes. If Liberia can settle up here, then they will have something to talk about. Anthony Lafour, who started a lot in Djibouti City, will start a lot here. The Memelody Sundowns man. Can he score? He's against Hassan Houdi. Anthony Lafour waiting for the referee's whistle. Lafour, there should be an opener for Liberia. And Lafour scores! Goalkeeper Houdi went right and the ball went left. And Liberia can celebrate now as they are in the lead. But well, Jim Salin Sadiba is somehow delighted now. Liberia won Djibouti nil. Nine minutes on the clock. <laughs> Goal number one for Liberia, I tell you. They start a lot. They've controlled the pace of play. And absolutely, I can tell you, Jim Salin Sadiba will not have much work to do here today because his team has proven yet in the opening stages. Well, I'm Jabo, he's just proving that he's actually back in this encounter. Djibouti now, they want to break away, they are down. Jabo, he goes to it. This is Well, I'm Jabo getting away. Reverie says his foul. He's trying to be rough now, Musa Ahmed. Captain, who is on the book now, after conceding a penalty, Kadao post one high up. It's beyond everyone, and so it will be. It will be a free kick to Liberia, a goal kick for the Liberia rather, a goal kick for Tommy Songo. And I tell you, the ATI has now come alive. This is what they expected earlier on in Djibouti City. Hella comes in. Dua Williams. And the ball is selling across the line. By. For Toronto. Liberia. Sam Johnson. Johnson is getting away. Finds Dua Williams. Williams tries to put one low in the box. But it's just far away. This is Solomon Grimes. Lafour is now the top scorer for Liberia in this qualifying campaign with two goals. This is Sam Johnson. But the ball is just uh, across the goal line for a goal kick to Djibouti. Hassan Houdi, who has been beating once now. A long ball. Selling away now. Solomon Grimes, 
brings it in into play. And Djibouti can bring it away. This is Hilton Vani. Comes all the way deep into Matthew. Dio Williams. Willem to Solomon Grams. To Captain Tia Dennis. Back to Grams. Grams to Williams. Williams looking for Sam Johnson. This is Liberia's chance now. Sam Johnson trying to get away. But he's still there. Sam Johnson. You see his power. Tio Weiss goes into it. And foul committed by Sam Johnson. And I see Hoyne is still on the ground. He's holding. I think that was a coalition between him and uh, a coalition between him and Sam Johnson. And the Marsh officials. Two weeks. The Willem Jabo. Keita finds Dior Williams now. Dior, Dior is there. Dior puts the long one to Anthony Lafour. In the box now. Lafour is there. He gets away from his marker. Anthony Lafour finds Dior Weeks. This is Lafour now. Lafour is still there. He's taking away Dior Weeks. Weeks is there. We two are straight from behind. Good call by the referee. Keita confirming with the referee. <laughs> I think they're trying to speak some uh, some French or, the, or Portuguese. <laughs> Hilton Vani, he got some good left foot. Can Hilton deliver a free kick here? Hilton post one in the bus, Omega to Lafour. This is two weeks. Weeks again. Hilton Vani. Hilton getting away. Hilton tries to post one through the gap. Captain Tia Dennis. Two weeks now. We goes down again. But the referee says this time the defender got it right. Djibouti. Push the long one through, but Solomon Grams brings it to chest to Tia Dennis, who goes all the way back to his goalkeeper. Joe Weeks, Keita, Omega Rabos, post one high for Sam Johnson. Said that now Sam Johnson can chase. This is Sam. Sam is there. Sam has been sandwiched. Sam tries to play one in the box for. Willem Jabo, but it's just clear of the area. Djibouti trying to break away. What captain standing Tia Dennis comes in. This is Hilton Vani, can break away now. Hilton. Hilton is accelerating. Anthony Lafour to Sam Johnson. And it's clear. Dio Williams was just there. I think Dio needed to put some anxiety into that a little bit. Because Jiba is saying all you need to do was to put your head into it. And uh, that would have been goal number two for Liberia. For the long bar is there, Sam Johnson can chase. Johnson tries to keep setting play, but he goes down. But the assistant referee says that was a fair challenge. Throw to Djibouti, Liberia coming close once more. Nice cross through from Sam Johnson. Djibouti in control now. The captain in possession. Number four for Djibouti is a battle. A long battle to chase this up. When we got Robert comes in, he has it across. Omega Rabos, Al Madin, is making this uh, appearance to the Lone Star team. After a long spare out, it's still 0 all between Tunisia and Togo in Lomé. And I can say for sure, Anthony Lafour, Lafour 
can try to use some speed. Lafort is getting away. Lafort, the captain comes in. Lafort gets away from him. Lafort! And all he needed to do, he had Sam Johnson and William Jabo before the post. But Lafort got to play one more time. on the press. Number 18 plays the through the gap now. Djibouti with the chance and it's cleared. Number 20, Hilton Van comes in for Keita now. Sam Johnson brings it down. Sam on to Tio Weeks. Weeks is there. Dominating midfield. Dior Williams. Dior is there. He's been sandwiched on to Hilton Vani now. Hilton looking for Willem Jabo. But nobody was why feel that was a wasted but a nice ball play by Hilton Vani. Omega Ramos. Hessel across. Omega is telling Solomon Grams you have to cover up behind me here because. Getting some loop from behind the four backs. Dennis trying to prevent the corner. Yes, he did it well. Offside. 19 minutes in this match. But yes, we've seen a real, real. Better game control from the Liberian side to pick up where they left it the last time in Djibouti City. But all they need to do is score the goals. One goal will not be very necessary in this game. Two weeks. Back to Omega. Looks for his captain, Tia Dennis. Dio Williams. Solomon Grams. Then pulls the long one for Jabo, but he's selling away. Djibouti coming in now. Asani Keita. Hilton Vani. On the box of Barragan controllers. Find William Jabo. Jabo trying to get away. Jabo is there, and the referee says it's still no foul. Trying to use some energy there. Nice turn from. Uh, Ahmed. Stop by Hilton Vani. Looking for Lafour on his chest. Lafour now struggling to control. I think Lafour goes down. It's a throwing. I think Lafour, I think you have to just. You have to deliver the boy in the area. Hilton has it. Sam Johnson. It's clad. Keita. Two weeks. This is Djibouti. The captain in possession plays a long one too for his uh, central attacker. But well, Tia Dennis was there. It's now it's Hilton Vani. On to Lafour, but the captain comes in. The captain controls beautifully. But he still have it. Captain Kada moving deep. Two weeks. Weeks is there. He goes down. Foul. I think you have to stop being fancy and put the ball forward and uh, get the results. That is what this match is all, all about. Get the three points with the maximum number of goals. Twenty-two minutes in this game. Anthony Lafour. Lafour is there. Lafour already have his name on the score sheet. Two weeks. This is Willem Jabo. <laughs> Willem Jabo wants to kick and he did it. 
but that didn't go just this way. But uh, the referee says it came in with a deflection from the captain, Captain Mohamed Kadar, who's not really happy. He played for Djibouti uh, in the Djibouti National Football League. So I tell you, and I see supporters are now pouring in, and the president has again announced a free gate. Dear Williams, post one in the area. There should be Liberia's a chance of uh, making it two. Omega Rabos, Rabos, and the player is down from Djibouti. He comes to finally. Magomer, Miguel Honey, and I tell you uh, some uh, dissatisfaction on the face of. Uh, Liberians are now pouring in. This is Omega Rabos. Keita. A long ball through the area. Is that away? But Keita brings it under control. He slips. Djibouti in control now. Number 10, Omar. A long ball through. Looking for. Musa, but the ball is just across the goal line for a goal kick to Liberia. 25 minutes on the clock. 20 minutes left in this half. Liberia will have to convince uh, the home fans by scoring another one. Sam Johnson. This is Lafour to William Jabo. This is Jabo. The captain is there. He's been sandwiched. And the bar is just across for a throwing to. <laughs> I think they keep running referee. They didn't get that one right. He's it away. Ominga Rabos. Post two for Lafour. Lafour didn't get hell on it. This is the captain. The captain has been sandwiched. And the ball is just across the line for a throwing to Liberia. This is Keita Anthony Lafour with the trip. kick for Djibouti. We ask down. Post one high up. Looking for his teammate by Hilton Van Class. This is Anthony Lafour. Two weeks. Weeks Anthony Lafour now. Again looking for weeks. Jabo. Is that? Is that it away? Omega Rabo has it. But it's still Djibouti number 10. Plays all the way back. Joe Williams. Oh, it's Marker. Using some skills. Joe Williams, get away from me. This is a chance for Liberia. Williams Jabo, mess kick. Wow, wow, what a chance again for Liberia. William Jabo, 18 yards out. Nice to sell up by Dio Williams. But uh, <laughs> the ball went spinning legs of uh, William Jabo.
Joe Weeks. We saw Liberia. There's a chance for Liberia now. Joe Weeks plays it to the gap. Sam Johnson grabs the battle. We got a game here. Liberia goes number two in front of Djibouti. 27 minutes on the clock. And Jim Stalinza Diva can now celebrate that he's satisfied with his team. The ATA comes alive. Sam Johnson. Two weeks of the assist. I tell you. Nice, nice piece of play. And Coach Kevin said we're having some pep talks with the goal scorer. Sam Johnson from Jugaday get his first Liberian goal. His first Liberian senior national team cap goal. And he can now say that yes, Liberia is up for business in this game. 2 0 as it remains 0 up between Tunisia and Togo in Lome and Liberia. We go a giant step closer to qualify for the Nations Cup at the top of the group. What a massive game for the Lone Stars of Liberia. Just on a half hour mark, the Lone Star is in the lead 2 0. Anthony Lafort and Sam Johnson, Sweden and South Africa. It's a nice connection. Hilton Vanny on the roster of Barragion controllers. Ravi says it's foul, Anthony Lafort. Keita Kles, Djibouti in possession. Two we wins it back for Liberia. We get away. Two weeks onto Sam Johnson. Two is there looking for Lafour. But Sam Johnson comes in. But Djibouti, the captain, Kadar, plays the long on the far side. For Hoin. Hoin can chase. Can he deliver across to? Hoin is there. And it's uh, the first corner kick to Djibouti in this encounter. Corner to Djibouti. On a half hour mark now, 15 minutes to go in this first half. Liberia leading 2 0. A long bar is true. Kokiba Sangwa comes in. And let's go number one for Djibouti. And the referee says it's no foul. As the goalkeeper was foul in the process. I tell you, they're very furious. They're protesting with the assistant referee. And that was, uh, it's no goal to Djibouti. I think they are protesting. They are protesting with the assistant referee. And we have to see, the put, they're kicking the ball across the place. And this is not good for them, I tell you. This is not really good for them. here. I think they want to walk off the field. <laughs> I think this is not really good for them. I can say for sure that uh, you have to continue on this match, no matter what the referee do. Uh, he's and the referee will take some decisions on the side there. Uh, a uh, yellow card. He shoot a player of uh, Djibouti. The yellow card. Uh, so that's the second player to go to the book in this encounter. But we've not seen any penalty for.
and I still see the, uh, some bit of uh, enthusiasm from Yusuf, the number four. Yusuf is telling us, man, hey, we have to play this game. We got some uh, international obligations to fulfill here, and that is exactly what it is. Sam Johnson and not only Lafour, I the two players on the score sheet here for Liberia. This is Liberia two weeks. Anthony Lafour, Lafour finds uh, Joe Williams. Williams brings him under control. Joe Williams pulls a long one through. Looking for William Jabo, but Djibouti can clear now. Omega Ramos. Keita. Keita. Long ball through, looking for Jabo. Nice call up there by the captain, Kada. Long ball through now. Solomon Graham comes in, wins it for Liberia. Graham gets away from his marker and he's down. This is Liberia, Gio Weeks, Gio Williams, Keita, Hilton Vani, to Keita. The Djibouti players marching forward for the Gaston loophole. This is Gio Williams. Williams to Lafour now. This is Lafour. This is Lafour. Lafour, that's going to be trusted. Lafour. Lafour is there, Lafour is still fighting. Lafour is still there, and the referee says there's no foul. But I think I told you Lafour needed to pull the ball forward. There's a CO Weeks to Keita. On to Omega Roberts. Tia Dennis, the captain. Kokipa Sango, post it high. Smith up. Willem Jabo. But this uh, a player beats by Smarko Squally. This is Djibouti now in possession. Admit. Post one high, the goalkeeper comes up. Finds Omega Ramos. Goalkeeper under pressure. Post one. Two for William Jabo offside. Take him quickly. Djibouti. Med. Long ball through from the captain. Kada. Omega Rabos. Finds his goalkeeper Tommy Songo. Yet to be tested in this game. Omega. Nice turn to Keita. Two weeks. Which goes down. This could be crossed for Liberia. There's a shot, and Tommy Sungo was just off his line. So, uh, Yusuf Bato was trying to was trying to take in off a little off target. This is Tommy Songo. Tia Dennis. Looking for Dior Williams. Willem gets away from his marker. Dior is still there. Dior, Dior is beating. This is Djibouti. Trying to break away. Dior comes in. Win the ball back. Nice. From uh, the third one yellow. A long ball now for Anthony Lafour to chase. Lafour is there. Lafour goes in the box. Lafour plays it to the guy. This is William Chabo! What a chance for William Chabo! I think he was just too eager. Chabo needed to score that one. Jabba needed to get that one right. I think he just uh, 
was just too eager. He's come close twice now. Kibuti, player post the ball high. Gio Williams turns around. Solomon Grimes, 42 minutes in this match. Just five, plus Alatan remaining. Sam Johnson has already put his name on the score sheet here. He's dispossessed. He's dispossessed. And the referee says it's foul. So it's a free kick to Djibouti. Liberia leading 2-0. They've not been too sharp. Sell it. This is Djibouti. Matt. Matt will it now. Matt hit on Vanny wins it back for Liberia. Nice slurry tackle comes in from Hoi Muhammad. The goal mate. Sell it. Tia Dennis. Has it back. Captain always standing. This is Joe Williams. It's the work. Sam Johnson is still there. You go start again. The referee says this time you have to come up. Joe Weeks. It's to Sam Johnson. Johnson puts it. Anthony Lafour. Lafour getting away from his marker. This is Lafour. Lafour tries to play one low with his left foot, but the captain intercepts. This is Silton Vanny. Head down. Two weeks goes in the tackle. Solomon Grams to Willem Jabo. This is Willem Jabo. But Jabo. Not having a good game at all. Anthony Lafour. Keita. This is uh, Joe Williams. Williams. Anthony Lafour. Lafour gives it away. The long bar is true. Hit on Vanny intercepts. Puts it low on the far side. <laughs> and Solomon Grams keeps it in play. We've played we play 45 minutes already. I don't know how many minutes of other time. weeks he's been very energized in this game Lafour happy a little with his knee Anthony Lafour happy a little now I don't know why he's going to continue this match, uh, but probably he got uh, potential substitutes here on the bench. Yes. Foul committed, the referee says. And that player of Djibouti, they still on the ground. We come up. I think he has a bit of muscle there with uh, two weeks. We 
huge place for MN in Cyprus. He played for MS in the Sapro First Division Championship. Hilton Vanny to Omega Rabos. They're having a holiday so far, I can say. Joe Weeks to Joe Williams. Williams, Solomon Grimes. Boris across his touchline. For throwing. Sam Johnson. Johnson goes down the very says fair challenge. He says uh, Djibouti. Very says his foul. On Liberia. And yellow card. Yellow card on Omega Roberts. Number five for Liberia is on the yellow card now. Omega Roberts. Uh, the man who plays uh, in in Serbia. Abu Bakar Omar, in a moment from now, I think the referee will sound off for the full time whistle because we had uh, stoppages. The captain, just away, till we had the captain, Mohamed Kader, has been doing all of the kicking in this match. Uh, he's probably, I think, the, the man for them. But this time he leaves it for Wasama Musa. Not Musa, but Hoying. The government Hoying. We take the free kick. Yeah, oh, he puts it high. That was no trouble to the, the goalkeeper, uh, Tommy Songo. And Liberia are on their way up at the top of the group. With nine points, with. Uh, Tunisia drawing with Togo in Lomé. Both teams will be on seven points. It has been a very outstanding first half for the Lone Stars of Liberia. We started off with uh, Anthony Snotin Lafo, who got it from the penalty spot after Willem Jabo went down. And uh, it was also Sam Johnson who got it on 27 minutes to make it 2-0. Some bit of protest after Musa headed in the corner uh, for Djibouti, but the referee said that was a foul in the process. And the coach of Djibouti has already been sent off. And Anthony Lafour has been very energized in this encounter. But uh, Willem Jabo has had some opportunities to scumble. Uh, so as it stands, it's Liberia to Djibouti zero as we go to the halftime break. Welcome back to the ATS in the second half of the 
2017 Africa Cup qualifiers between Liberia and Djibouti. Liberia leads 2 0 in this encounter. Songo, Jabo can chase. Wolam Jabo, Jabo is there. Jabo make it 3 0. Great run by Wolam Jabo. What a goal, I tell you, that was spectacular. I think Coach Jim Zanisa Diba did some very good pep talks back in the lockout room. Nice ball to Wolam Jabo, took on two defenders of Djibouti, overran them, and just were placing the ball into the back of the net. It's Liberia 3, Djibouti 0. This full fed in the box of the Liberia national football team. Jim Salizar did by the Kelvin Segway. That's how it was before. And they are giving thumbs up to their players. It's been a real easy match for Liberia here today. And country Djibouti now. Tia Dennis, the captain for Liberia. Bernstein, Omega Roberts. Foresta, Big Great, this is Keita, to Anthony Lafour, Lafour to Dio Williams, Williams is there, this could be number three, number four for Liberia, this is William Jabo, what a save! Fantastic save, I tell you, that was a brilliant save by goalkeeper Hassan. Solomon Grahams. Dior Williams brings you under control to Grahams once more. The captain, Tia Dennis, the man from Adelaide. Omega Roberts. Keita. On the pressure, the referee says a fair challenge. Djibouti now and just too far, just ahead of uh, Yusuf Bato. Your weeks. Weeks. The Grams. Grams pins it. He knows that he didn't do well with that. Weeks posted the touch. And the referee says it's foul. Free kick to Djibouti. The captain, they said, for Liberia. Solomon Grand post one high up. To Sam Johnson, this is William Jabo. Jabo again. Jabo to Sam Johnson. This is Johnson. Johnson tries to bring it under control. Back it to Lafour. Lafour didn't just control that one, but this is two weeks now for Liberia. Which to Lafour who shoots. Brilliant save. Hassan has been kept quite busy now. Hassan Goody, the man from uh, Giara in Djibouti. He's been kept busy in this game, I tell you. Nice piece of save from Lafour. A long ball is through now. A stop. Djibouti, Keita. We set back to two weeks. Which fast Lafour. Playing from the left hand side now. Lafour gets away from his marker. Lafour squares one in the area. It's the other way. Dio Williams. But it's intercepted. That goes down from Djibouti. This is uh, the number 17 who pulls the long one through. It comes there to the high. Bar is on the far side. Djibouti controlling now to Bato. Bato, it comes there to Musa.
Liberia, absolutely going to go on top of this group. Free kick. Free kick to Djibouti. Just outside the Liberia gold area. Point was brought down by Captain Tia Dennis. And Buba, Abu, Abubakar Homan. Omar to take the kick for, Liberia, for Djibouti. 52 minutes on the clock. Oh, my shoes and come and stop me some goal with a save. And a FIBA one comes there uh, with the reply from uh, Horny. I'm Hussein. Preparing my shaman now to come on. Substitution to come on here for Liberia. And I think Bas Shemon will replace Atoli Lafour, Sam Johnson, to Dio Williams. Dio is bidding to it. Revy says it's foul. Chibuti. Number 17 for Djibouti. That's Mohamed Manier posts one high up. Two weeks. We go down easily. The very sense is foul. Tia Dennis. Two weeks. Weeks to Robots. Omega. This is Hilton Vani making his first senior cap in this game. Playing it through for Willem Jabo to chase, but too high for Jabo. You already got his name on the score sheet. The man from uh, Deportivo yeah. for the dinner in Spain. He was on the score sheet uh, yeah. just before the international break. Against Hoska. He scored a winner in that game. Anthony Lafort, who had been the show. Uh, substitution. The man from the Melody Sound Downs will come out for his uh, contingent base. The man who is also part of his platoon in South Africa, Pashaman, from all of uh, Black Aces now with uh, Santos. Your weeks. We said, get away. Find Omega Roberts. It's a long one through now for Sam Johnson. Johnson. Johnson plays the true but intercepted. Nice defensive work from uh, Kadia. And he received an applause from the Liberian supporters. He's a lesser weapon. But unfortunately, he's playing from behind. Bas Sherman, first attempt is uh, handball. Substitution for Djibouti. Number seven will be coming on. And he's replacing Hussein. Magnet, Magan and Hussein. Magan and Hussein. And coming on is uh, 
Abdul Razak Dahir for Djibouti. This is Liberia, Willem Jabo. Jabo Kugot, the most. Oh! Jabo scores a brace. Liberia for Djibouti nil. 76 minutes. And James Zibak can just know that he's going on top of the table with absolute, absolute brilliance. Willem Jabo, with a disappointing first half, has now scored goal number two for himself in this qualifiers. Liberia for Djibouti now. Plenty of more time to play in this game, I tell you. Djibouti trolling by four goals to nil. Two weeks. Revy says his foul. This is number four. A long ball through now. The chase is up. But the ball is just across the goal line for Liberia goal kick. Tommy Sango on the holiday today, I tell you. Place a shot to Solomon Graves. Jabo. Oh, Keita. Revy says advantage is for Liberia. Tia Dennis puts it long. Sam Johnson keeps it in play, but it's just across the line. Joe Williams, the subject to Abdul Razak. Long ball now. Finger rubbers who has it through. Abu Bakar Dara. Dara mobile indeed. South Solomon Grams throws the long. Zerel away. Djibouti in possession. Abdul Razak. Long ball on. Uh, this is number 10 for Djibouti again. Abu Bakar. Omar. Solomon Grams. Graham plays it too long for Sam Johnson. Johnson breaks it down. Johnson is there. Johnson trying to get away from his marker. Johnson does it well. Johnson and the referee says the foul against them. Johnson. Captain Kadav standing his grounds. Plenty of time to play here. Abdul Razak. Solomon Graham wins it back. This is Abdul Razak, the substitute. The referee says it's foul against uh, Tio Weeks. Free kick. Djibouti, number 11, to take a kick for Djibouti. Another substitution, number 5. Number 10 is coming out. Djibouti number 10, Abu Bakar Omar. He has played well in this match. And he will be replaced by the number five. By Ibrahim Idris. Ibrahim Idris. A long shot comes in. And <laughs> I think uh, it was very tight. So it's coming to Djibouti.
Nice shot from uh, Yusuf Bato. Nicola comes in. And the referee says. A bill of discussions between. Tommy Sango. Hey, Don Vani. Looking for Pat Sherman. Sherman. Touring to Djibouti. I agree with they are a very new footballing nation. And they're doing well against a country that produced the FIFA World Player of the Year in the form of George Weah, Bas Sherman, Willem Jabo, not anticipating that one, but Djibouti can break away now. One, two between them, and the own bar is there. Here comes uh, Djibouti. Ravi says it's no foul, and Tio Wee comes in, finds uh, Joe Williams, Solomon Graves, to Williams once more. They're controlling the game now, trying to play the ball around. This is Liberia, Keita, Pash Sherman. Sherman looking for Hilton Vani. But Vani plays it to Shema one time. There's a pass Shema. This could be go for go for Liberia again, but uh, poorly delivered by Shema. Seku Kwane coming in. And now for Joe Williams, so I can say. The man from uh, Bethany and Steel in the United States. Joe Williams, to Kate, uh, to Tio Weeks. Grapes, this is Williams. The man from Gaffel in Spain. Williams now to Sam Johnson. Johnson straight into the arms of the goalkeeper. Djibouti. This is the substitute, Ibrahim. It's uh, Abdul Razak. Razak is moving towards it. But uh, Liberia with it, two weeks past Sherman. Long ball now for Willem Jabo offside. Sam Johnson will make way for Seku Kwane. Sam Johnson from uh, Jugaden in Spain. He scored on uh, 27 minutes in this game. And the man who came on is Seku Kwane. They uh, were and Steel. He used to play for FC Oz in the second division league of uh, Holland. That's the Netherlands. But now he's moved back to the still in the United States of America. Nin 19 years old. He thought to switch nationality. Uh, one more substitution that we could see here probably giving a cap to Dauda Batu. Batu also has considered to play for Liberia. 
after some uh, sting with uh, with the Norwegian youth national side. Tommy Songo, Songo from Les KFC, made his debut against uh, Guinea Bissau away from home. Keita, a bit of some experience there. Ominga Rabos, this is Pat Sherman, back to Rabots. Tommy Songo. This is Tia Dennis, the captain. This is Keita. Asani Keita. Look for Sodomo Grams. Grams is there. Foul. The Revy says it's no foul. But it's touring to Liberia. One more substitution. A long ball. Probably Kojiba who anticipate giving. Down with that bar to his first cap. Two weeks. This is Keita. Back to weeks. He turns around. And Jabo was just beating to that one. Omega Rabos was just hiring that on uh, Abu Bakar Daura from Jabatel in Djibouti. I think the referee. It will be. Musa, Osama Musa, and Bato. Musa shoots, just not targeting that one. A goal for them will be quite enough, especially traveling away from uh, home, all the way in South Africa. Salma Graves. Comes to Dio Williams. Williams to Weeks. This is Williams to Grams to Weeks. Weeks turns around. On to Keita. Just too high. 20 minutes left in this game. Plenty of more time. Liberia need to score the goals, the maximum goals. Joe Weeks, we getting away on the Jabo to pass Sherman. Sherman was just beating. A long shot! The first clinical shot from Djibouti. Abubakar Dare and Gogi Tommy Songo says I'm the man in charge. He went just placing it over the crossbar and Djibouti has the corner taken quickly. Keita. Keita is there. Tries to put one high up. But it's into touch. This is Liberia. Djibouti over better hand now. Djibouti over chance in outside the 18 about and the shot comes in. And Tommy Songo saves that one to the disappointment of uh, Wasama Musa. Songo post one high. Willem Jabo just bouncing off his boot. Bash Sherman looking for two weeks. Weeks now. This could be positive for Djibouti. Weeks is there. We're looking for Seku Kwane. And this is Joe Williams. Well, I'm placed it high. This is Jabo. Oh, 
Willem Jabo on the hat trick now. Abdurazak Keita wins it. Omega Roberts, Hill Damvani, making his uh, senior international debut today. There's a Seku Kwane. Kwane is there. There's a Squane. Kwane. Kwane finding two weeks who miss kick 18 years out. I tell you, Liberia are creating the chances for scoring the goals is what matters. This is Djibouti. Abdul Razak goes back. We steam it. This is the substitute. Ibrahim finding the captain. Kadar. He'll done Vanny Class. Segu Kwane can chase. But the captain Idris Kamsin, a Kada. He's done Vanny plays a one for two weeks. This could be cross there for Djibouti. Liberia looking for number five now. Two weeks. Weeks is there. Weeks. Things finds uh, Willem Jabo. Jabo is there. Jabo finds Joe Williams. Williams tries to get away. Willem. Goes down, but the referee says it's a throw into Djibouti. Djibouti in Matthew, Yusuf, Adou Razak, Razak Keita wins it. Two weeks beating by Yusuf to place it to the gap, but Tommy Songo is up quickly. I think Liberia need to be pressing to score more goals. But they, they're killing the play now. I haven't seen much of Asham since he came on. Sherman to two weeks, which to Minga Roberts. This is Captain Tia Dennis. He wants to search forward. Seku Kwane just missed head. The goalkeeper Hassan. Taking a goal kick now for Djibouti. It's finished zero all between Tunisia and Togo. So Liberia will be at the top of the group with uh, Tunisia in second place and uh, Togo in third place. Seven points apiece between Togo and Tunisia. And Liberia will be left with nine points in the group, two points on top of the table. Abdul Razak taking on Solomon Grams. Razak 
Goes back. This is the long ball through offside. Thirteen minutes of no more time left. And Well I'm Jabo, Seku Kwana now. Seku has been sandwiched in the process. Seku 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 they're trying to get away. Foul on Seku Kwana. Asani Keita will probably be making a way here. In Liberia, we play with three central forwards. <laughs> what an irony. I think Dibale is still satisfied that he needs to score more goals. This is uh, Seku Kwane. Seku is there. Seku. It's free kick. To Liberia, you know the referee says it's just an advantage, and so he gives a yellow card to number 19 of Djibouti, Muhammad Med. Last year, to take the corner kick. A bit of uh, talking there between the referee and players of Djibouti in Liberia. Referee signals and pass them a post one and a zealot by Ominga Roberts. Djibouti can break away now with their captain, Mohamed Kader, but hit on Vani. This is Kader pressing forward now. This is. Bah Sherman. Bah. Bah Sherman to Segu Kwana. Segu shoots. Substitution. You saw Batio is off. And Mohamed Hussein is on for Djibouti. Ten minutes of no more time left in this match. Heldon Vani, but the captain of Djibouti. Omega Rabos Al Madin leaves it for his goalkeeper. Tommy Sango. A long bar is there. Seku Kwane all alone. Seku. The sandwich. Seku Kwane getting away. Seku play there to the Pashaman. There's a Pashaman, but the Ravi says he's offside. Nice, nice move. Djibouti in possession. Lombard is there. Ominga Rabos brings it down on his chest. Controls. Finds uh, Bash Yemen. But Hilton Vani stops it. He's been efficient from the left hand side. Yeah. 
Gio Williams. Willem get away from his marker. Willem Jabo. Jabo trying to have some run. Oh. Djibouti in possession. Number 11 for Djibouti. Idris. Abdul Razak. Tia Dennis, the captain, puts it across. Solomon Graham stops it. But Djibouti intercepts. Hit on Vani. He's been very energetic in this game. Vani. Post one high up for Keita. Omega Roberts. Roberts on to Keita. Keita. To Dior Williams. This is Dior. Looking for Segu Kwana and lands to William Jabo. Jabo goes down. <laughs> William Jabo, he has scored two times already in this game. But I haven't seen really much of him. It is going to be a tour into Liberia. Dennis to two weeks back to Dennis Grams to pass Sherman Sherman is there I see Jabot in front of goal and I think I was just trying to Yellow card to Willem Jabo. <laughs> I don't know from which instance, but I think uh, a bit of collation there on the pitch. Dawda Batu will be making his international debut for Liberia moments from now. Uh, he's been on the roster.
Misongo. Now. We're playing to other time now. This is a long ball through for Dauda to have his first touch on the ball as a Liberian player. Foul. Foul by Dauda Batu. Liberia, Ominga Roberts. Roberts, long ball now to Dio Williams. But uh, it's intercepted by Djibouti. It's intercepted by Tio Weeks. Ravi says it's foul. Booty. Bashemant. Hilton Vani to Bashemant. Vani plays it long. Looking for Willem Jabo. But Djibouti with it. Breaking away. Abdul Razak. Razak trying to play low on the face of God. It's cleared. But Djibouti, that gets away, puts one higher up to the skater, Dauda, Dauda now looking for Segu Kwane, Dauda is uh, dropping in the area, Segu Kwane looking for Willem Chabo! Chabo has scored a second international hat trick for Liberia. It's Liberia 5, Djibouti, Ndeo, Willem Jabo. That scored three times in the second half. What a delivery. Seku Kwane, brilliant cross, and Willem Jabo winning, just playing a low in the back of the net. It's Liberia 5, Djibouti, Ndeo. Willem Jabo, the man from Double TV Open for a dinner, he was missed away from home, and now he's come at the ATS. And showing that class. Nice connection. That was a bottle to Seku Kone. And Kone deliver a brilliant one in for Willem Jabo. And Jabo made a five for Liberia. 94 minutes on the clock. It's Liberia five. Djibouti Neo moving at the top of the group A. Qualifying champion for the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations. And surely, Djibouti knows that it's over here. And that's the end of the match. Liberia has been in Djibouti, five goals to zero. He had the answer to the third most in continuation of the 2017 Africa Cup of Nations qualifiers. Izagi, come quick, come quick, come quick. Izagi, come quick, come quick, we've got to fuck up. Where will Where will I'm Jabo? Your second international hat trick. Uh, what are you up to for, like, for your Liberian career? Uh, what <laughs> <are> you But William, William, just tell us what does that mean for you scoring your second international hat trick? First of all, thanks be to God for today for giving me the strength 
and the energy to do what I did today. I thank God to him be the glory. It's a proud for me and I like to give it to the Labrim people. They call me to work for them and at least I can do the work, you know. So I just appreciate and, you know, doing the best for my country and helping us to the African Cup of Nations. It was now good for us to you know Yeah, football is dynamic. You understand? You just have to be patient, perseverance. You watch your opponent, you study the tactics, and you get what you can get. Can Liberia qualify? You are at the top of the group. Yeah, we can qualify by the grace of God. We got all things are possible. And you are not at the top of the table. You think? Thanks be to God for the victory today. What can you tell Liberians in one word? Let all love one another. And you know, let all love one another. The most important thing, once we have love and we're together, we can reach the top. Thank you very much. Thank you. God bless you. You, well, I tell you, that was, um, I tell you, it's been, it's been absolutely a fantastic victory here for Liberia. For a very long time, the country has not enjoyed a victory as such. And quote, Jim Stalin said, Dibal is now here with the media. Yeah, so, on, uh, you know, we, as I said, when I took over, I'm here to build a team, and I'm in the process of trying to accomplish that. It's a good prospect for Liberia, the combination of uh, Dauda and Conan resulted to the last goal. What's your take on it? That shows that, uh, you know, uh, Liberia has a lot of prospects. If you are at the top of the table now, what can you say? Are you, are you anticipating qualification at this stage? Uh, yeah, not yet. I said we still got a lot of work to do. We can be complacent now. I know what complacency can do to a country. That happens to all. Uh, that robbed us of our uh, Lone Star, I mean, the World Cup qualification. I'm not going to be passive, sit back, and think everything is over. We what? still got a lot of work to do. Oh, you score five, but uh, it, was, it was an out here tax. Your, your attackers come with a lot of chances. Yeah, it's football. You know, you can't, you, can't, you, can't, you can't convert all the chances in the game. That's what they call football. What do you achieve your success so far? Hard work and dedication. My players are dedicated now. I'm ready for Tunisia. We're far, far from Tunisia here. Yeah. we got to concentrate on Togo first. Well, the coach of uh, the Liberian national football team, the Lone Star, Jim Salin Sadiba, giving us the pep talk about uh, today's all important account. So we're still making way where we can talk to some of the, the Liberian national football team players. And, uh, and we see Sam Johnson. Uh, Johnson has been on the score sheet today. And Sam, probably Sam can just give us uh, a bit of uh, impression. What, what do you make of the goal score today? Uh, yeah, I think I'm very happy. This is my first goal for the Liberian national team and for the, the country. I think I'm very happy. Sam, tell us, how, how did the victory come today? Yeah, I think the victory come to, like, we were all organized. We work as a team. So long you work as a team, you get a good game. I think so. What message do we have for Liberians now? As yeah, I think, for like, uh, for every time I see my Liberian brother and sister of the state, I feel happy. They all come and support us. To all Liberian, we are ready. The Liberian loans are ready to give a visit anytime. anytime. Are, are, are you hoping to go to the African Cup? Yeah, we are hoping to go to the African Cup. All the players on the team, because I show like, if we have an open opportunity to go there, we have a very big contract in Europe. I think so. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you very much. Well, I tell you, that was uh, uh, Sam Johnson. And we're still making the attempt to see whether we can uh, get to uh, Anthony Sinatin Lafort, the man with some uh, Memelody sundowns. Uh, uh, Lafort opened the party here today, and that is absolutely a fantastic result for them. Um, uh, Sekou Kwane uh, gave the assist for the first, uh, for the last uh, goal. Uh, he could be uh, the most delighted like, man. He didn't score, but he possessed, uh, he gave the assist. What can you say about today's victory? Yeah, it was a nice victory. We make the country happy. That's what we talk about. We need goals, we need goals, we need goals, and we score five. I hope everyone is happy and to continue. And we think we can make the African Nation Cup. That's the goal. You think you are now overcoming your nightmare? Yeah. Everything is okay now. I'm very happy. And we will celebrate with the whole country. That's what's on my mind now. Can you qualify for the African Cup? Yeah, we have we still have two games to go. Togo will play us home. At home, we are always good. With the fans behind us, we can beat Togo. What do you think will be a major impediment in getting to the African Cup? Yeah, we have a big chance. We have nine points now. We want 12 points to qualify, so let's fight for it. We can make it. Thank you. Thank you, brothers. Well, that's how we, we call it here um, at the Antoinette Todd Monster. It's been a massive game. It started up with Anthony Sinatel Lafour, scoring from the penalty spot. Um, Sam Johnson came on uh, to also finish up 
on 27 minutes. Willem Jabo scored a hat trick in the second half. Give Liberia a 5 0 victory over Djibouti here at the Antwerp Stadium. Keep watching LN TV News and we continue to build up here. With, uh, with... Well, I can say there's been a massive game here for Liberia today. Beating Djibouti by 5 goals to 0 in the 2017 after a couple of nations qualifiers. You know, it all started off with uh, Anthony Lafour after Willem Jabba was signed in the box. Same jersey, same jersey made it 2-0 as Liberia went to the break. Willem Jabba scored a hat-trick to make it a 5-0 in the form of Liberia to move on top of the group as Tunisia and uh, Togo play to a goalless draw in Lomé. So Liberia now tops the group with 9 points behind with Tunisia and Togo in second and third place. Is this a sign that Liberia is tough to reach their third African Cup of Nations history? With this generation of players, one of the two legends of Jim Salis Adiba reached the 2017 African Cup of Nations. That is an unsigned question. Until then, from us here at the Anthony Tottenham Stadium, my name is Moses Gazo. As you can see, my voice has been really, really strained up. Mama Reese has been behind the camera. And what is it? Many thanks to all of our technical crew members for helping us here to bring you this all important encounter between Liberia and Djibouti here at the Antonio Todd Mosterian Monovia.